Police are certainly not going to ask the pastors to break anyone's trust. What they're hoping is that pastors can convince people to trust law enforcement. What we're trying to do is use any and everybody we can to break through that barrier. Deputy Chief Jakari Young has been at plenty of crime scenes. There's a victim, but witnesses sometimes just fade away. Even if they don't necessarily respect law enforcement and the police, some folks, they may respect the pastors. So the deputy chief has enlisted 10 local clergymen willing to participate, training them to respond to crime scenes, particularly the most violent, including homicides, where fear of retaliation can silence witnesses. Because people are more comfortable with talking to the clergy. Pastor Rory Carey is among the group who will be additional eyes and ears for police. He says faith-based leaders have relationships with people, whether they are on the right or wrong side of the law. Carey is confident crime scene witnesses will talk to him and the others. Convincing them they have a duty to their community will be a challenge, but one he thinks he's up to. It is through prayer and through the word of God that you're able to get through to the hearts of men. Police want to be certain the pastors are prepared to be on crime scenes, so they probably won't deploy until they train a few more months. In Daytona Beach, Volusia County, Claire Metz, West 2 News.